Storm Tracker weather starts now with meteorologist Joey Bianconi. And happy Monday. Some nice colors out there as the sun rises today. Mount Helena right here. We have some showers in the vicinity. Still about 41 degrees, so a little cool to start off your morning. A nice sunrise out there in Great Falls as well. Also 41 degrees. So across the state, it's a little bit of a warm pocket here in central portions of the state. We're in about the mid to upper 40s in places like Lewistown, Roundup, and Billings. But the rest of the state, well, it's quite chilly out there. We're in the lower 40s to even low 30s in some places. The wind not so bad right now. We're about 14 miles an hour out of the southwest in Great Falls. That'll increase throughout the day, though, especially in southwest Montana, where we can get gusts of about 40 to 50 miles an hour, especially down here near Livingston and Dillon. Later on in the afternoon hours, at least along the Rocky Mountain front, not so bad today. A few stronger gusts, but I think along the Rocky Mountain front tomorrow is going to be when we'll see most of our stronger gusts. Even This is even tomorrow morning around 4 a.m. Already some pink showing up, indicating gusts of over 50 miles an hour. And pretty much the entire state tomorrow will see some gusty wind. And even in a Wednesday, places like Lewistown could get some stronger gusts as we have wind shifting out of the north and northwest for most portions of the state, cooling us down a little bit. Winter storm watch along the Rocky Mountain front here east of the Continental Divide, including St. Mary and parts of East Glacier for about 6 to 18 inches of snow. A little bit less snow here in the Little Belts and High Woods, but still up to a foot of snow in some places just to the south and east of Great Falls and a little bit closer to the capital here. A winter weather advisory for today, actually, for some snow shower activity in southwest Montana. Could get isolated uh, instances of up to eight inches of snow in some of the higher elevations. And a fire weather watch for tomorrow for places like Lambert, Glendive, and Circle in eastern Montana for some gusty wind and low relative humidity. Radar, we have some shower activity near Lewistown, but most of our Snow showers are to the west near Missoula, so we'll take a little closer look at that. That's what's coming towards Helena here. You can just make it out in the camera view into the distance, but Missoula has been seeing some pretty constant rain and snow showers throughout the morning. So has Hamilton, but that's slowly making its way eastward towards places like Phillipsburg, which is in the middle of that winter weather advisory. Taking a little bit zoomed out look at the Pacific Northwest here, another upper level low making its way into Seattle right now. That'll give us some moisture over the next couple days. And there's that system that caused all the severe weather over the weekend in the central plains. Luckily today for them, that threat is lower. But for us here today, Day, some shower activity near Helena and Great Falls as early as probably the late morning hours here in western Montana. Missoula still getting some pretty constant rain and snow showers. That stronger wind in the southwest picking up at around noontime today. Some heavier showers and thunderstorm activity throughout the afternoon hours. Look at all these heavy thunderstorms making their way towards Lewistown later on in the afternoon. And then some activity will die down into the night, but we'll still have some lingering snow showers into the higher elevations, and that will continue on through the next couple days here. We could have snow showers pretty much for the next seven days. We will be quite cold. 50s and 40s showing up for a lot of the state. Vigilante Day Parade will be nice at least. Some showers in the afternoon.